Bank statements, personal checks, even letters you consider junk are all being targeted by thieves looking to make a quick buck or maybe to steal your identity. And they're finding what they want right outside your home. Eyewitness News reporter Melissa Duran did some digging today and found out what these thieves are doing to hit the jackpot. She is live near North Buffalo and Lake Mead to explain. Melissa. Well, Dave, mail theft continues to be a problem here in the Valley at 5.30 on Monday morning. These mailboxes were broken into. Now, thieves are finding way to get around security precautions just like this gate. Anything to get your, their hands on your personal belongings. It's a gold mine for thieves. Mailbox after mailbox stuffed with anything from pre-approved credit card offers to social security checks. And in Las Vegas, more and more thieves are cashing in. They go for the biggest bang for the buck. They're hitting the big complex mailboxes where they can get in and get out and get a lot in a short amount of time. Pacific Legends West Condo Complex was hit by one of these thieves early Monday morning. A burglary where these eyes in the sky may just pay off. Here's surveillance video of the suspect. He originally walks in, looks right at the camera, then walks out. But one minute later, a man wearing the same jacket and same shoes walks in. But ironically, he has a mask. The suspect makes sure no one's around, then quickly gets to work, using a flathead tool to bust open the mailboxes. Residents who saw this video were in shock. Randomly choosing what he wants to take. You know, he's not taking any of the tabloids. He's taken what he wants, and around this time, this is when usually people get the social security checks. I think we're talking identity theft. This person is looking to either open up credit cards in someone's name or write checks um, on someone's checking account. What's worse, residents here think the suspect lives among them. Metro is now investigating, checking for fingerprints, looking at the video, and questioning residents. But there are precautions you can take. Because most mail thefts happen between midnight and 5 a.m., the Postal Service recommends checking your mail every day and never sending out mail after the postal worker makes his pickup. Residents here are learning that lesson the hard way. But their hundreds of dollars in safety precautions may actually catch their suspect. Again, cleaning out your mailbox daily could make a huge difference. That way, if the thief does strike at night, your stuff is safe and the thief could leave empty-handed. Reporting live, Melissa Dudon, Channel 8 Eyewitness News. Thanks, Melissa.